Okay, hello again. Um, this is the second of two tutorials. Uh, we've done our drawing. Uh, we've created our sorter on Google SketchUp. What we're going to be doing now is I'm going to be showing you a way to present your work ready for handing in. Now you can just print out straight from Google SketchUp and you'll get a drawing of the sorter or a printout of the sorter at that particular angle. But because Google SketchUp we've got lots of different angles that we can have a look at, what we'd like you to do is to present almost like a collage of different views of your design. Now I'm going to use uh, PowerPoint which I've already loaded up here. Uh, the reason why I'm using PowerPoint is really good for uh, manipulating and moving around images. Um, you can use Word, you can use Publisher, you can wa use whatever you, you feel comfortable with, um, but I find that Word does a few silly little things with drawings if you don't get the wrapping correct. Uh, so I'm just going to stick with, with PowerPoint on this one. So I'm going to choose a view. I can zoom in and out of my view. Now it's good practice to obviously fill your your page. So I'm going to come up here. I'm going to all brown. I'm just going to have a, have a nice view. Okay, that's a nice view. I haven't gone over the edges. And what I'm going to do now is to do a print screen. So I'm just looking for the key on my laptop. There we go. So I've just clicked on print screen. If I come down to my PowerPoint page and go to paste. Okay, it pastes a picture of the whole screen on there. It's a bit big, so I'm just going to drag it a bit smaller. And I'm also going to double click, which gives me the crop option. So I can crop my drawing down so that I haven't got the edges of my, of my screen there. So I've just got my drawing. There we go. So there's there's my first view. Let's move that to one side. Back to Google SketchUp. Let's choose a different view. So I'm going to orb round. Let's have a view looking down on top like that. Print screen again. Let's paste it on. Same process as before. So just reducing it. Move it to one side, double click, gives me my crop tool. Let's just crop it down. Okay, so there's uh, another view. Okay, I'm just going to do this once more. So I'm going to go to my orb tool, let's move it around. That looks quite a, a nice view. Let's get it all on the page. I'm just going to come up like that. Just going to tweak it, make it look really good. Okay, happy with that. So I'm going to go for print screen, back to PowerPoint, paste it on. There it is. Reduce the size so I can work on it more easily. Double click, get my crop, crop it down. Okay, I'm going to put that down here. Now you can have all of your images uh, the same size or you can make them different sizes, you can have them overlapping. So you can play around with how you actually want to present your page. I've got three there, you get the idea, I'm not going to do any more. You can pan around, we'd probably like you to do uh, four or five images maybe. Uh, it's important to have a title, so I'm just going to pop a title on there. Okay, Mr. Waits Sorter. Okay, up there. And there we have our presentation drawing ready to hand in with different views. Okay, thanks very much for listening and look forward to seeing your work.